slow ahead. I can go slow ahead. Come on down and chump some of this shit. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not locked in here with you. You're locked in here with me! What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is the Knights of Horror. I have taken... About a week off, but I'm back. We got some videos to shoot. We got some stuff to talk about. But today we are going to talk about a horror movie that not a lot of people really know that's a horror movie. But when you find out it's a horror movie, you're kind of like, okay, it makes sense in a way. But uh, this movie, this is one of the horror movies that's actually rated PG. Uh, this horror movie is The Infamous Shark. You already saw it in the intro. This is horror movie talk. Jaws. So without further ado, let's get started with this video. Starting off with the plot. Now with the plot of this movie, it's really simple. It's, you know, um, we start off at Amity Island. It's this little island um, that you have to like take a boat just to get to and stuff. And Amity Island is kind of like your uh, typical, you know, family kind of getaway or, you know, it, you know, the beaches are nice there and stuff. A lot of people show up to the beaches. So one summer, um, we see a lot of, uh, you know, families just chilling at the beaches and stuff, and all of a sudden, um, they get reports of shark attacks. We see one, we see a couple people get, uh, drowned and killed by shark, by this shark that's going around killing people. Uh, and then it starts scaring the townsfolk, it starts scaring the people who are visiting Amity Island, who are hanging out on the beach, and it starts scaring people not even to go in the water. Now, as the movie progresses, then you see, you start to see a lot of people who are, um, all trying to get together and you know take out the shark to make the beaches safe again um, and you know you see people trying to kill sharks over and over again this movie is actually based on a novel which was Jaws the author does come out in this uh, movie actually too and he has a really stupid line in the movie that's really funny though uh, we're dealing you know throughout the whole movie they're dealing with the shark and um, yeah a shark a great white shark and we see that um, you know one of the captains who ends up taking a crew out to the ocean says if you really want to catch this shark I have a way you know because then we have all these crews that are just going out just killing random sharks and it's not even the shark that they found and stuff when they thought they killed one shark they hung it up on Amity Island just to kind of prove like this is the shark that was uh, terrorizing people we killed it the oceans are safe again but when we go back in the oceans and we see a better look at this we see that Bruce the shark which was that's what they named him on said they named him Bruce that he is back and he's still killing people so they killed the wrong shark and they're just killing random sharks and stuff fun fact about this movie um, they actually uh, put Great Whites on the endangered species list after this movie because after this movie came out, people went out in the oceans and started hunting them like crazy. So they put in a bad, uh, you know, endangered species. They put them on the endangered species list because they needed to put a stop to it. So uh, they get this crew together. Um, it's the main lifeguard, a scientist, and this guy who owns a really big boat. And he knows a lot about the seas and stuff. They get this crew together and they all go out. Another fun fact about this movie, the scientist and the guy who owns the boat, they did not get along a lot on this set. And um, a lot of the fights and stuff you see on the movie between them two were actually them arguing. Steven Spielberg, the genius that he is, he thought he can use that to his advantage. But sometimes he got too far. Um, so, you know, there was one scene where they're all drunk and stuff. That was actually them being drunk and he just kind of ad-libbed all that and he just rolled the camera so Steven Spielberg is one of my all-time favorite directors um, he's directed so much stuff in the past and Jaws is another one of the great masterpieces so you know they, they embark on this journey and they're you know trying to hunt down the shark they go all the way out into the like uh, in the ocean and they try to hunt down um, Bruce the shark 
Uh, we go on a lot, kind of like a wild goose hunt with this shark, and we do see them um, eventually bait it in with um, uh, chum. Uh, you know, so you know as they're baiting in the shark, we saw in the opening sequence, he baits in the shark, and the shark pops up, and that's when he tells him, "You're gonna need a bigger boat." A lot of the people throughout uh, the time this movie's been out think it thinks he says we're gonna need a bigger boat he's actually saying you're gonna need a bigger boat but um you know when he first tells him that he kinda just is like oh you're lying you're doing this that and that but then he finally sees the shark for himself Bruce then actually de takes down the boat and sinks the boat to uh, you know the ocean and the two the scientists and the uh, guy who owns the boat end up getting killed and the lifeguard is the only one alive so he ends up killing Bruce and uh, making it out alive when a uh, um, how can I say it when the National Guard goes out and finds him uh, all in all though you know Jaws is a great movie I have talked to like my parents and I have talked to like family members and st stuff and they said when that movie first came out they were even scared to go in the bathtub that's how much this movie scared them they were scared to go in the deep end of the pool because they thought Jaws was gonna be there now I can see now that we are kind of you know we don't have that same mindset as they did in the 80s and the 70s but you gotta remember they didn't have technology like we did so we're not too scared of that stuff and like as they were growing up uh, they would tell us one thing and they would believe it so now Jaws is known as one of the uh, greatest horror movie cult classics of all time and like I said one of the only horror movies I know that is rated PG um, it's by far a classic and it's by far one of my favorite Steven Spielberg movies and um, it's just a great movie all in all you know it's got a good plot to it it's about them hunting down a shark and getting uh, revenge for them killing all the victims that didn't deserve to die so that's gonna be it today for horror movie talk this is probably gonna be the shortest horror movie talk but it was on my one of my favorite movies Jaws if you guys never seen Jaws go check it out I highly suggest it um, if you guys never seen Jaws, you know, you want to pause this video and go watch it, then come back to this video, as this video will contain spoilers. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate you supporting the channel. We are almost to 100 subscribers. Uh, this video is up on Thanksgiving, so, uh, as of this recording, um, I mean, if it's past Thanksgiving, it's going to be an awkward message, but... Um, this video I posted it up on Thanksgiving so have a happy Thanksgiving guys have a safe Black Friday if you guys do that kind of stuff and uh, we have a lot of good Christmas stuff coming around a couple new videos click out um, the next video that should be out now or should be out next is the horror movie talk for the movie The Babysitter which is a Netflix um, exclusive movie that was really good it was a kind of a horror movie a horror comedy movie it was pretty good I did a, a horror movie talk on that and another video that should be coming out soon or maybe already out or it's probably already out as you're watching this if you're watching this it's one of my old videos and stuff uh, the first ever HHN 2018 predictions I already have three of them if you want to know what they are go check out that video I highly suggest it and thanks for watching guys I, hi I really appreciate all the support you guys give me and I will see you in the next video